Okay, in this video we're going to look at two nonlinear diophantine equations and prove that they have no uh, solutions over the natural numbers. Um, okay, good, let's get started. So this first one is 3x squared plus 2 equals y squared. And so we're going to do both of these by contradiction. So this first one, let's say, by way of contradiction, suppose that x and y in n satisfy uh, 3x squared plus 2 equals y squared. Now, uh, the next thing that we're going to do is consider this equation mod 3. So consider this modulo 3. So notice that's going to give us the following. So obviously 3x squared is congruent to 0 mod 3. So we'll get y squared is congruent to 2 mod 3. 3, but you can easily check that 2 is not a quadratic residue mod 3. In other words, this has no solution. And you can do that by taking all possible values of y mod 3 and then calculating all possible values of y squared mod 3. So we have 0, 1, 2. 0 squared is obviously 0. 1 squared is 1. 2 squared is 4, which is congruent to 1. But none of these are 2, so that means uh, there is no solution and um, we have a contradiction but so I'll say but this has no solution in other words in terms of the Legendre symbol 2 by P is equal to negative 1 um, so there's our contradiction so this next proposition has a very similar proof. If you want to pause the video and try it right now, that's probably a good idea. Um, but otherwise, I'll get started. So uh, let's uh, start off by assuming we have a solution. So by way of contradiction, assume that uh, we have an x and y natural numbers such that the following is true. 7x squared plus 2 is congruent to y cubed. So now what we'll do is consider this mod 7 so we can get rid of that. So we'll look at this modulo 7. But that's going to give us the following congruence. That'll give us y cubed is congruent to 2 mod 7. Now what we can do is find all perfect cubes mod 7 and notice that 2 is not one of them. So I've done that uh, and I'll just like do it very quickly. So <clears throat> there's no point in doing uh, 0 because 0 cubed will be 0 which is obviously not 2 so we'll skip that. So we'll do y, y cubed. So let's do 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So notice 1 cubed is 1, 2 cubed is 8, which is obviously the same thing as 1 mod 7. And then, uh, let's see, 3 cubed is 27, which is congruent to 6 mod 7. 4 cubed is 64. 64 is 1 more than 63, so that is uh, 1 mod 7. Good. Um, 5 cubed is 125 which is congruent to uh, 6 mod 7. I'll let you guys check that. And then 6 cubed is uh, 216, which is also 6 mod 7. Notice it's 6 more than 210. So uh, maybe we'd finish this off by the following, but this has no solution, so we have a contradiction.